we are Lockie and Ash. Two Aussies stuck in Austria during the COVID-19 pandemic. We've been renovating our van during isolation. So jump in our van and watch part two with us. It is day six and we are off to the hardware store. Ashley's gonna get some groceries. It's gonna be a fat old time. Let's go. Got back from Obi and from shopping. Just got the two supports in for the bed that run down the middle. I've actually offset them a lot because they're actually going to be snowboard supports as well. We're going to hang all our snowboards up while we're traveling just to save a lot of room under there. And we're putting our bed slats on now, and that's going to be the bed done. And then after that, we're going to paint all our cornices white, get them all finished. <laughs> site we are all about OH&S as you can see um, we've got some really good footwear on both of us we don't skimp out on safety here so now we're cutting the cornices to go around the bed frame yeah, just cut that on 45 to make it all neat is that how it's done yeah wow you sound so enthusiastic What are you writing? Love letters? Sure. It's writing on the back which side it is. Oh, whose clever idea was that? You smart ass, aren't you? <laughs> Do I get a pay rise? No. Mm. I've just painted all the little cornices for around the bed frame so they're ready to hopefully go in tomorrow. And Lockie's just pulling apart the kitchen. This was old timber we recycled and we put another piece of timber on that. So it would look nice. Now we've got to take it apart and all the screws are under it. So I've got to take off all the timber. And we're glued on, which is a real bitch. But... My poor kitchen. But it will be better in the long run. Wrapping up day six. Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts? Are you happy with the progress? Mm -hmm. In a little words. Tonight. As I said, oh h and S, we're all about it. What you reading? Trying to make sure I've got the right terminals to where my power is going in. Which I do. We've just blown a fuse, that's all. Day six done. What have we do today, Ashley? Groceries, hardware, cornices, painted. So I went to the groceries, went to the hardware store, painted, put in the gas detector. Bed slats, bed. bed. Slat, cut pieces for the corners here. Painted them. Uh, removed the outside of the kitchen, ready to change over the kitchen back because we've uh, moved the kitchen so it's gone a bit crappy so we've had to replace that which we'll do tomorrow. What's the ETA for finish date? Two days. Okay, so he said two days, you heard him, two days. That would make it Thursday. It's a big call. Yeah. The rains are coming for the weekend, so good timing. Ma! A the rains are coming. Hi guys. It's day seven. Lockie's just pulled out the kitchen this morning, so he's taken the bench off, pulled the shelves out, so it's in pieces. So he's going to put a new backboard on it um, and do those few changes to it and then hopefully it will go back in. Um, we're also going to do some painting today, put in our cornices, so hopefully by the end of the day it will be looking a lot nicer. Oh yeah, bend over. Look at that beauty. Look, he's actually working on a tan today. Who wears short shorts, hey? Alright, so we just added some insulation to go around our water pipes because in winter they were freezing over. 
when it got extremely cold so we're hoping that this insulation is going to work and keep them from not freezing over. No guarantee yet but we're hoping. painting the little cupboard inserts um, that nice charcoal color so just waiting for that to dry so we can put the skirting on around it Lockie's um, securing my chair back in next to the kitchen bench that we made the little extension for um, so hopefully we're on track to finish soon Listening to some Hamish but, um, Andy today? Yeah. Inspiration, well, see if we can start a podcast. Nice. I feel like, like I'm pretty funny sometimes. She knows these intros go for Do you? An hour. Has yeah, anyone ever told you you're really funny or you just think that? The the to be honest, I just think is, it. Is, <laughs> positivity uh, is the key here. Yeah. You've got to yeah. laugh at yourself and like your own jokes. <laughs> day number, what day is that? Nine. Day number nine of the renovation and we're nearly done. A tiny bit of roofing to put on, just in a little. Areas. Tables just getting polished a little bit more and then that's going to go back in and one more wall to paint and then we're done basically. Floor. And the floor to put in as well and then we're done. We're good. We've got our snowboard rack in the back so yeah things are moving pretty quickly. And look he said that it would have been done by yesterday. He's actually running behind schedule. Well maybe if you didn't keep going for a walk in the morning and do your exercise in work time, did it before work, you might be done. But he forgets that I did like three hours OT last night, cleaning all the shelves and the cupboards, putting everything away. <laughs> So we are redoing our floors. We're putting down this like self-adhesive sort of laminate that's sort of a bit stiffer than the one we had before. The one we had before was like a roll-out mat and you can see all the lines that you cut. This one's just a self-adhesive stick on so we just peel this back, stick it on and we're just cutting out our grooves in the floor and then pull it off and stick it on basically so we put the first one on just beside the chair and it looks really great so we're just going to keep, keep continuing on and see how it goes. need to be done when a few things arrive. We're pretty much ready to move back in which is super exciting for us so let's get this mattress in. Okay, so we've just finished our van renovation. We're gonna have a van tour coming up and what we've done and why we've done it in the next week or so. So make sure you hit the subscribe button in the corner so you're notified as to when that comes out. Thanks guys.